the easiest one for you to find to start is the biggest, like the widest muscle here on the flexor side. And this is the palmaris longus. So that's by far the easiest one to pick out on the flexor side. And if you find that, you'll be okay finding the others. So there's four we're covering. So the palmaris longus. Um, one up from there is the flexor carpi radialis, towards the radial side of the arm. And then the pronator teres. Which on most of them, when it starts like from the elbow joint, it looks like a triangle. Uh, and then it typically gets smaller as a long arm. So palmaris longus, flexor carpi radialis, and pronator teres. So if you're memorizing the way I've listed it, it would be pronator teres, triangle looking, flexor carpi radialis, palmaris longus, and finally flexor carpi ulnaris. So we're just doing the superficial muscle, so we're not covering this muscle under here. So if they were uh, flush like this, it'd be palmaris longus. And then this other big one is the flexi carpi ulnaris. So those are just the four on the flexor side. So again, pronator teres, flexor carpi radialis, palmaris longus, and then flexor carpi ulnaris, okay? And then if we were to flip onto the extensor side, first major muscle is the extensor carpi ulnaris, beside the flexor carpi ulnaris. So extensor carpi ulnaris, extensor digitorum lateralis, extensor digitorum, which is typically in line with the middle finger. So that's kind of maybe a marker to start it on the extensor side, but I think you'll probably just find it easiest to continue from the ulna. So extensor carpi ulnaris, extensor digitorum lateralis, extensor digitorum, and then the last two um, are typically fused together. Some of the TAs are just teaching it as one muscle because it's not, you can't differentiate that well. But it is extensor carpi radialis brevis and extensor carpi radialis longus. And there's a bit of like flesh on this one still, or skin, but they are um, two different muscles and they fuse together. If this was pulled off, so this is two muscles. You can kind of faintly see the line. Um, There you go. So there's a faint line that would, that's separating the two muscles there. You can kind of see that. So it'd be brevis and longus. Um, I probably won't test you on that. The, the, you can't really see them. Um, but for your own knowledge, um, and for going over all five, they are fused together. So again, extensor uh, carpi ulnaris, extensor digitorum lateralis, extensor digitorum, think middle finger, and then the two fused together here, Extensor carpi radialis brevis, extensor carpi radialis longus. Okay. So they're really amazing. Okay.